Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Mm. Okay, I thought I was done with snacks, but I just found a bunch more like candies and things. So I'm just gonna show you these. This is some, I think this is just a chocolate bar, but it's Slovakian. So we're gonna try it. It looks pretty standard, generic. Mmm, it has something in it. Mmm, it tastes like alcohol. Oh my gosh. I just thought this was a normal plain chocolate bar. It doesn't look like anything fancy. It's a really good. I think it has alcohol in it. It's really good. It's like a weird liquor caramel. Oh man. Okay, I'm definitely gonna buy more of these. I wonder what liquor's in it. Like maybe rum? I don't know, it's really good. This, I just wanted to try this weird Orion chocolate because they sell a lot of it. I think it's actually owned by Nestle. And I think this is pistachio, even though it looks like weird foamy mint, but you know, I'll try it. It does have like a very fake pistachio center. And then there's like a layer of caramel above it. It's okay. It's not bad, it's just extremely sweet. I think Clever is like Billa's store brand or something. I have no clue what this is. I keep picturing it being like the center of a Butterfinger, but I don't really know. <laughs> Whoa. It doesn't look brittle like a Butterfinger. It looks like, like a weird marzipan nougat thing. <laughs> it smells toxic. I don't know what it is. I don't know, it's not bad, but I'm like afraid to eat it because it literally smells toxic. I don't know what's in this. Okay, I'm definitely throwing this away because I just translated it and it's literally a soy log. It's a rum coconut flavored soy log. So that's going in the trash. These, I don't know that these are Slovakian because they put a, a separate label on it with like Slovakian writing. But doesn't it say, it's like milky sweets. I feel like it's probably like caramel. Okay. Oh my gosh, that is toxic. That literally smells like the beads from the Pretty Pretty Princess bead set. Are these safe to eat? I don't know. It's like in a weird, oily, waxy wrapper. That, why does that bag smell so bad? It's, oh, it smells very sweet and milky. Whoa. I was thinking it was like a caramel. It's literally like a block of sugar. Hold on a minute. I think this is like Russian maybe. It could be Russian or Ukrainian. That is straight up a block of sugar. I mean, okay, don't get me wrong. I'm a sugar addict, so I like it, but it's basically just like pure sugar with a very tiny hint of like maybe half percent caramel milk flavor. And, it's, and the rest of it's just like sugar. Okay, let's see what else I got. This is something that I've been seeing on like different menus when I've been trying to find like a place to get Slovakian food, but they have it in the freezer aisle. So I'll try it here and then I'll try it later when I go to a restaurant. It's like these weird like dumpling potato 
things filled with poppy seed. It's a dessert. Doesn't that look like the weird bear from the like snuggle? Snuggle? Is that like fabric softener or toilet paper or whatever? You know what I'm talking about? That bear? Hi, I'm Snuggle. I just opened this bag. I thought they were gonna be like these little gnocchi sized things. Look, they're like huge. Whoa, they kind of got stuck together. It smells very poppy seed like. Mmm, mmm. I think this is kind of like made out of potato. The dough is. No, oh, it's filled with poppy seed. I'm glad I did not salt the boiling water because it already has a hint of saltiness to it. But the filling is really good. I love poppy seed. Mmm, 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 mmm. I love poppy seed. Poppy seed. I think with a little bit more butter and powdered sugar, it would just like take it up to the next level. These are a winner. I would definitely eat these again. I think this is like a weird communist era cola brand. I got the sugar free one because I don't want to just like eat a can of sugar, but we're gonna try it. And I am not a soda person at all, so I'm not like one of those people that's gonna be able to probably tell the difference between like this and regular Coke. Oh, I feel like it has it like a slightly citrus hint to it. Oh. It's really bad. Okay, I know I said I'm not a soda connoisseur, but this is bad. <laughs> it tastes, first of all, it's extremely sweet. Second of all, it tastes like watery and uh, it just tastes like very fake and weird. I don't like it at all. Okay, this, I don't know what this is. It just looked interesting. It's a cheese and the, the label said it was like traditional. It's all written in Slovakian, so I don't know. I'm gonna try cheese. Mm. I'm just gonna stab it open. I don't even know if I can eat this. I like stinky cheese, but Oh my gosh. It smells like like sheep fur or like goat hair or something. I think it's sheep cheese. Oh shit. Oh. Okay. Mo. Oh my god. That literally makes me I feel like angered that there's such a sick cheese. That was disgusting. It, that was disgusting. That was disgusting. It tastes like you're eating a bucket of goat fur mixed with band-aids. It's really the most disgusting thing. And it's not just the smell, it, the taste, it tastes exactly how it smells. Like, oh, I can't even, I need something. Oh. That's going straight in the trash. Oh my gosh, that was, that was sick. That was the, the sickest thing I've eaten. Okay. Wow. It is time. If you didn't know any better, you would think I just lived off dairy and alcohol. I think for tonight's beer, I'm going to try the 35 cent one with the fryer. 
or monk, whatever that is on it. Upon first sniff, it smells like college beer. I mean, I don't know. It literally tastes like college beer. It's definitely probably one you want to chill. I mean, I don't know why you'd ever want to order beer. But this tastes generic to me. I want to go out of my way to buy it again, but for 35 cents, I mean, why not? going for the IPA. It has 4.1% alcohol. This is color. I don't, I don't know what that means. Color is 8.7. And then this is, that translates to bitterness. So bitterness is 36 and it says it's like a light, like citrusy session type IPA. Whoa, 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 whoa. It smells like weird electrical wires. It smells really weird. Oh, I can smell like the citrusy IPA, but when I first opened it, it literally smelled like weird, like electric wires. I don't know. Very light. Oh, so it tastes like a more watered down light version of an IPA. Like it's, it definitely has bitterness to it, but it's not super strong. It's kind of like light, watery, slightly taste. And then at the end, you get this like weird hit of like floral fragrant, but not in a good way, kind of floral taste. It has a weird aftertaste. I don't really like it. are going to try this one now. Doesn't have a very strong smell. Mmm, okay, it's it's uh it's not bad. It's kind of decent. It's definitely the best out of all the beers I tried. <laughs> maybe not as like bitter as an IPA. It's maybe a little bit more mellow but I like this one. I'll probably actually really drink this. Still have these sitting here almost full because I feel wasteful throwing them away, but I don't want to drink them. <laughs> okay, well, it's a winner. We're gonna try this, I don't know. I've seen it at all the stores. Gosh dang it. This isn't even Slovakian, it's Czech. I keep buying things from Czech. I don't even know what this is. Again, it smells like, kind of like a cheap college beer. I mean, it tastes kind of like the other one. It's just kind of like a watery, neutral beer. <laughs> but I guess if it's like hot out, you just want something like cold that's you know, a little more flavor than water, then <laughs> that'll do the trick. I have this, I swear this is my last video. Every time I go to the store, I'm like, okay, I'm done buying goodies. I'm just coming for toilet paper. And then I end up leaving with more stuff. But for real, this is my last video showing you stuff from the grocery store. So I wanted to show you baked goods. Obviously. Well, I haven't been to any bakeries yet. So maybe they have good baked goods there, but the grocery store baked goods so far have not looked or tasted impressive. And most of them only have bread. It's hard to find like sweet treats, but one thing that all the grocery stores sell is donuts. They look really bad, but I figured I should try them because they all sell them. There was one at the store. It looked like the Simpsons donuts, like the pink kind, except it was like literally this thin. It was like weirdly thin and they call it a Simpsons Disney pink donut. <laughs> but I got this one. 
I think it has like crushed up like Smarties on it or something. Feels like very doughy. Okay. It smells like a donut though. It's extremely doughy. I'm really in a sugar mood lately. I'm gonna eat the icing off. It tastes like a grocery store donut, basically. This one, they had some, oh, oh, I got like a really strong hit of like salt or baking soda or something. Ew. Now that I have a closer look at this, it looks really crap. It was called pudding something, I don't know. I just saw the word pudding and I thought it sounded good. It's raspberry with like pudding, I guess. The pudding is like non-existent. I don't know if it like soaked into the bread or I don't really know what. The jam's kind of good though. I hope I just really want sugar. I made those crappy brownies last night. And even though they were awful, I wanted sugar so bad that I ate half the pan. And now it's sent me into a sugar spiral. Okay, this one is poppy seed. I love poppy seed, so I don't really like bready stuff like that. It's, it's not even good, I'm not even gonna eat it. I'm just gonna eat the filling. Wow, I love poppy seed. There's all the sugars and frostings and things going and it's just bread left. The last thing we're gonna try. Ooh, stinks. I don't know what this is. It looked very big and glossy, so I thought I'd try it. I translated it with the camera app on my phone and it translated to apple rub cake. Rub, R-U-B. I don't know what. That means it looks like maybe it has some kind of like syrup soaked on it, some kind of glaze. It smells apple-y. It's weird tasting. It tastes like preservatives. I don't know, is that like gelatin that's making it all shiny and weird? So in the middle has this like weird apple pie filling with gelatin, I guess. It kind of tastes like if you opened up one of those cans of apple pie filling, you know, you can get them at like the store, I guess, Walmart or wherever. If this had like a custard sauce to go with it, it would be edible. The bottom is kind of soaked. Not sure in what though, something sugary. Okay, I'm done. I just like ate that whole thing, I'm going crazy. For real now, I'm done with the grocery store food. So I hope you like seeing what kind of goodies you can get here in Slovakia. Definitely found some wins. Definitely had some total misses that just went straight in the trash. But yeah, it's always fun to go into grocery stores in different countries and see what goodies you can find. <laughs>